Hey yo, what's up everyone to the first out of two bonus episodes of the Uncle Karius Fishing Boy series. So uh, I can already tell that it is a good time to end the series because this is when uh, bugs start to happen the most in mod packs. And uh, you may be like, gamers, what bugs, man? I don't see no bugs. Yeah, I don't know where uh, <laughs> the uh, water kind of just vanished from existence. I, I have no idea why. Why, how, when? It looks like there's no water up here, too. Like, water has straight up vanished from this world. It might have to do with something with Autismo taking over. But let's not talk about that. Alright, let's check out the uh, ocean. Make sure. Okay, I mean, there's water still over here. What the fuck? How did I just fall? I walked in water. But, uh, I mean, I guess we're good. There's still water. What about the dungeon? Or not the dungeon, but, uh, the, uh, abyss. Not abyss. Whatever, you know what I mean. Over here. It's fine over here, too. What the fuck? What I don't know what happened. But yeah, we're gonna, in this episode, there's two things we're gonna be doing. Or, in these two bonus episodes, there's two separate things we're gonna do. In this one, we're gonna try and max out our lure, lures, lure output. And, uh... We're gonna go for the next episode. We're gonna go and try and kill whatever remaining abyss bosses there is and kind of see what weapons they drop and shit. But for now, it is time. It is time. Oh, one more thing I want to show off. A lot of people said, yes, I should spawn this in when I asked for it. I just completely forgot about it. Oh, I spelled it wrong. It's the Fulger Shark, which was supposed to be our late game shark pickaxe. It's fine. Let's just see how it looks like big i'm assuming no homo i can reach that far what the fuck yeah that's what it looks like it's just a shark a fulgur one <laughs> i don't know what that means i don't know what a fulgur shark is but that throw it out throw it on the floor that's what it looks like i do, uh, i kind of see a shark it looks like a type of hammerhead i don't know whatever it don't matter but yeah we're gonna be using a good bit of mods here. I don't know how many mods max out your lures. I know we have tackle box, and then I know we have obviously battle rods. So uh, let me look into everything here, and uh, I'll see you guys in a second. Let me try and craft all this. All right, I have gotten I think the max amount of things we can get from uh, tackle box for uh, increasing our lures, and that is dragnet and uh, Kelvin. Kevlon. I don't know why Kelvin was in my head. Kevlon spool. And for battle rods here, we got a good bit. I think we're going to go for this one, though. The countless one. This might take an extremely long time to make. I hope I have the hooks for it. But here it is right here. Box of countless lures. Lures. However you want to pronounce it. Up to 32. Got it. There's probably some other items, honestly, that we can make. Don't worry about it right now. I only have two hooks. Uh, I don't know how. <laughs> I don't know how we're gonna do this with just a handful of hooks. But uh, we'll try our damnedest. All right. Well, there you go. We ran out. Can I make hooks? Like the ones that I need. Oh man, I'm gonna have to farm these somehow. So uh, I will be right back again, I guess. All right. This took way longer than I wanted it. <laughs> it's the end of the series. I don't know why I'm not just cheating. All right, hold up. Turn this off. That piercing my ears. This really doesn't give you that many hooks as quick as I thought it would. But I mean, at least we're getting them. That's all that matters. So we're gonna type in lure. And we'll, we'll put that. One, we'll put it on to show all recipes. So we're able to make two of these. Wait, hold up. I need some more luminite before we can actually make two of them. Thank the Lord that I farmed the Moon Lord, right? Uh, I needed to farm it for the Dragnet specifically. But uh, what was I doing? Lure. Boom. We should be able to make two boxes, right? That's what we need. Boom. And of course, you know, I got the reserves of Fractalite and Amalgamate. Specifically, every episode I would prep for this. Every pre-episode and post-episode, I'm prepping for the box of countless lures. Because I think ahead of time. I think that's good. I think we have everything we can get. So uh, let's put it to the test here. You ready? Let's put it to the damn test. I don't know why I put this out. There you go. Okay. Boom. Boom. 
I think it's because I have that, isn't it? No? It just doesn't want to equip. Alright, take it out then. There we go. You ready? We're, we're going to just try it with a containment unit and see how it looks. It doesn't even look like that many. What the heck? Yeah, it doesn't even look like... What, what the heck? That's kind of upsetting. Uh, okay, what about with the fishing shotgun? Okay, it looks like a good bit. Now let's see with Uncle Karius's fishing pole. Oh, Mio. I think it's always been like that. Alright, it's kind of upsetting. I don't, I don't really think it's having too much of an effect. Let me see here. Okay, so this one does eight. Yeah, I see eight. This one does four. I see four. Put them together, that should be 12. I don't see 12. <laughs> that, uh, I don't know. Actually, that might be 12. Honestly, it's really hard to see. Because the lines are so close together. I don't know. Mm, now that I look at it, no, nah, it does not look anywhere near 12. Alright, and this one does 32. Are they all supposed to be like together like that? Maybe it's because I have this. Oh, damn. Okay. That looks like 32, to be honest. Maybe it's because I had this one on the faster fishing can. Alright, let's try again. Let's try again. Oh, here we go. This is feeling this is feeling like a good bit. So we should have what? 44? 44 hooks? I have no idea, honestly. <laughs> let's go to like the ocean. And let me just like fish for the one time and see what happens. Let's just see what happens real quick. Oh man. So that like fills up my inventory and then some. I mean, it's not that bad. It's nothing. I'm glad I didn't go out of my way in the playthrough to like get it. I don't think it would help and at all <laughs> if I did go out to get it. But let me just try something here. We're gonna fight a boss now. Don't sell me mystery candy, you fucking freak. Uh, we're gonna fight. What's the easy hard mode boss? I guess maybe Kakatar. Sure. Let's do this. Let's fight him. And uh, we're gonna see if it is more effective or not effective at all using. 30, 44, however many things we have. Come here, boyo. I mean, I feel... I don't think it's effective at all. <laughs> I mean, maybe if I was trying a boss that... Oh, hold up. That was... It went from not being effective at all to, like... That boy got insta-killed. What the fuck? Hold up. What did I do wrong the first cast? Alright, let's, let's try that again. Let's see what happens. I'm, I'm not sure what happened there. Maybe that was just the ride. Oh, well, we don't have the Omni Lure on. It's fucking dark, bro. Make it daytime. Oh my god. <laughs> I don't know. I, re I really can't tell. I really can't tell if there's a difference at all. We're, we're just gonna assume there's a difference. Uh, the only, uh, the main reason why I didn't do any builds with the, you know, a lot of lures. It's because this, when I right click with the Uncle Karius' pole, it does a little like bug. I think that's due to Omni Swing. Um, I'm pretty sure Juice confirmed that this is due to Omni Swing. But there was that bug during the finale where my hooks would like do this, like cast, and then pull back in. People were saying like they think it's Omni Swing. And someone even said like I took out Omni Swing and it worked again. I've been told by a couple of people that Omni Swing is not the problem for that. I think it's just compatibility all around in the mod pack. Alright, so one more thing before we end off the episode. I'm going to grab a Zerg potion. Quick Zerg potion for the boys. I didn't mean to take your torch off. I'm very sorry, man. Uh, boom. We're going to fight a little mini boss that I hope spawns in the version of Calamity I have. And uh, we'll end the episode off on that. The mini boss doesn't have that much health, so it's not like it's going to be an intense fight or anything. Here we go. Sandstorm it up. And then... I hope it's like... Wait, do I have a solution? I don't care a solution with me. Whatever, it's fine. Uh, no, it does matter a lot. Give me my solution. Wait, no, what? So I had the solution in there. There it is. Okay, I was about to say, like, I'm not blind. I swear that I put the solution specifically in there. Alright, shies again. We're gonna purify this so no corrupt boys spawning. And let's do it. 
Zerg potion activate. Now there should be a mini boss in here. And we'll notice the mini boss when we see it. Now, I'm not talking about the desert, bitch. I'm talking about a legit mini boss. Let's see if he spawns. So far, so bad. It's just these guys spawning. Slimes just as bunnies and a bunch of cactus people. But not cactus cactus people. I like that type of cactus people. Hey, don't kill him. I need him a lot. Don't know. I don't know about that. You kind of jumped through that door and killed him. Come on. Something spawned. Not all these fuckers. Alright, we gotta... Gotta get rid of these guys. Y'all taking up spawns now. Y'all are just taking up spawns at this point. You gotta all go. Come on. Oh, I haven't even seen the regular mini boss. I have a Zerg potion active. Let's go. Show me the money. Or get if. Oh wait, there's the actual mini boss. Get obliterated. Oh my God, can it actually do damage? I mean, look, this is like one of the main uses of having uh, multiple lures. But that's also what we got Uncle Karius' rod for, is to you know, throw out the fish. This shit is annoying. <laughs> it's so hard to use. It's so hard to use multiple lures. But, uh, yeah, I'm not seeing the mini boss spawning in. I have no idea if it spawns in the version we have. I know it's in the version. I don't know if it spawns, though. So this is what we're going to do. We're going to spawn it in. I feel like, oh my geez. I feel like it would have spawned in by now. Like it definitely would have spawned in by now. So a uh, quick no zerg potion for the boys. Get out of here. And then we're gonna go to show NPCs and we're gonna type in sand. Sand. There it is. Great sand shark. Come back up. You see what happens. So he's got like the same AI as the ranger sharks. It makes cool noises though. Maybe he's just a rare spawn. Because this boy would not spawn in. He's getting killed by something. I don't know what. I haven't touched him. Oh, just touched him. Desert Quartz. Large skill of an apex predator. Ooh. What does this make? Dust storm in a bottle. That sounds like it's not that bad. Oh, we could low-key make that? Yo, I should make that right now. Sand Shark NATO staff. Let's see it in action. Sand. Sharknado staff. Oh, I'm missing something. Ancient cloth. Are you kidding me? All right, let's try this again. Cloth magic magically appeared in my inventory. All right, boom. I just want to see it in action. Oh, that's it. I thought it would be way cooler. It's just a reskin. <laughs> what the fuck?